Welcome, my name is Joe. Today we're going to talk about opus processing with RS2. Before we dive in, a little bit about Event38. Event38 Unmanned Systems founded in 2011 and with the growth of the AMOLED products, we opened a new website, E38 Survey Solutions. We've added other survey accessories and software to the line with much more on the way. Uh, with that said, let's jump into opus processing. We're going to go over settings on the RS2, OPUS settings, and how to fix errors that occur because of it in incorrect settings or processes. The R2K settings of the RS2 should be set for static. Select GPS only with an update rate of 1 Hz. OPUS only processes GPS, so adding other constellations will only hurt us by having such a large file, uh, which can, get a, can give OPUS trouble. With that said, if for some reason you must or have stored more constellations, that's okay. We can fix that later. In the logging settings, make sure raw data is off until you have the RS2 at the proper location. Once you have set the RS2 in that location, power on the unit and set the raw data to RINEX 2.11 and turn on raw data. Turn off raw, raw data after collecting data and before turning the RS2 off. If you don't properly toggle power, that's okay. We can fix that later. Uh, if you do not set the correct Rhinox format, that's okay too. We can fix that later. So after storing your file, go to the Opus website, upload your file, uh, set the antenna reach to the AMOLED reach RS2, set the antenna height, which is measured from the ground to the base of the antenna, plus 134 millimeters. Add the email address where you want the results sent to and press uh, up, upload to rapid, rapid static or static depending on the length of your collection. If you receive upload errors or, or other processing errors, it's often because the file was not prepared properly based on something like the wrong Rhinex file or not toggling off raw data before powering off. We'll go through three fixes for common errors. All these fixes will be done using RTK Convert. To fix improper log starting and stopping, we'll trim the ends of the Rhinox file. First, we'll open the Rhinox file in something like Notepad and note the time of first observation and the time of last observation. In RTK Convert, set the time start a few minutes after the time of first observation and set the time end a few minutes before the time of last observation. To fix an issue with too many constellations on, go to the option settings in RTK Convert. Make sure the only satellite system chosen is GPS. The frequencies should be L1 and L2. To fix the issue of RINEX set to RINEX 3, go to the option settings in RTK Convert, set the RINEX version to 2.11, and after making your changes, press convert to generate the new file. Process the new file in Opus. And Opus will send an email with an Opus solution or other errors that may, result, may be related to data quality. Um, my name is Joe. Thanks for joining us here.